cabinet minister of the ruling NRM government have consented to the removal of bail for people on capital offenses, credible sources indicate. In a special cabinet meeting which sat over the weekend, ministers unanimously resolved to side with General Museven on having bail scrapped for suspects on capital offenses. Hello, welcome, and thanks for taking your time joining us live on Progen Media TV. That brings the latest news and the latest updates in the country and across the world. It may be your first time to be on this channel, but kindly do one thing. Subscribe and turn on the notification button. You will be updated with all our top stories. Uh, let's take more look into some of these details. The seven cabinet consents to bail removal and however pundits have warned those in favor of the draconian amendments will at some point fall prey to the same. Cabinet on Friday also ended the police act to deny suspects on capital offenses bail and police bond. Sources say none of the ministers objected to the development in fear of clashing with the President Seven, who has the power to reshuffle any of the cabinet members. The ministers singled out suspects on rape, murder, treason, aggravated robbery, among others, to endorse the reforms, and they urged that people who attain bail tend to spark anger within the communities where they live. Each of the ministers was given a podium to echo out their views and surprisingly, all of them were in favor of the amendments. The Attorney General Chiro Wachwanuka, who was also in the tension, session guarded on how the proposed constitutional amendments would he achieve. He guided that Article 23 of B of the Constitutional shall include a clause that the suspect shall not obtain bail till at least 180 days on remand. He also proposed bond denial within 48 hours until a, suspected, uh, a suspect is arraigned to court. And now that cabinet has given its take on the reforms, the next stop over shall be parliament where lawmakers are expected to vote on the reforms in a house where the ruling NRM party has majority seats, chances are high that they shall vote in favor of their party chairman, General Yoel Kagota Museven. Well, that is it for now. Thanks for watching. Progen Media TV will keep on you updated. Just kindly do one thing. Subscribe, turn on the notification button for all these updates. Once again, thanks for watching. Progen Media TV.